Hey guys, so kind of got some big news today. Um, Adrian bought me four new packages of socks. We will all go together when we go. What a comforting fact that is to know. Universal bereavement, an inspiring achievement. Yes, we all will go together when we go. Here they are. Um, we got two pairs of black ones here, one argyle and one pin dot. Uh, two pairs of gray ones here, one with kind of a I don't know, geometric pattern there, and the other one's got just kind of a subtle uh, herringbone uh, on the top and then a stripe on the bottom. This one uh, is kind of a black version of these gray ones. Um, black here with the geometric pattern and then the black herringbone on that side. Um, and then here, a um, little bit different. These are uh, kind of a grayish brown argyle with uh, you know the red and the navy blue there. And then the other side, you got a uh, kind of a chocolate brown, um, almost an oxblood really, with uh, a red toe cap and heel, um, which you can see just a little bit of there. Um, but you see there, uh, Morona two pair classic socks. Um, I'll zoom in on that so you can get a better look. Classic socks, cotton comfort, uh, which is something I, I you know take. You know, put a lot of stock in when, with my socks. Definitely have to be cotton. Um, and they were only three dollars and fifty cents uh, on clearance. Um, it's a really good deal for these socks. Uh, you know, normally these uh, these types of socks would run you like five, maybe six dollars. So um, yeah, uh, zoom in a little closer here. You see um, two pair, which I already kind of went over that. You can t tell uh, they're definitely socks based on this little uh, icon here that tells you they're socks. Um, and for shoe sizes 6 to 12, um, as a size uh, 10 and a half, maybe 11, depends on the shoe, shoe, the shoe brand, you know, obviously those are going to be a perfect fit for me. Um, made in China, not the best. Everyone knows the best socks come from Taiwan, but, you know, China, China will do. Um, and just swing down here real quick. You see they also offer co cotton softness and comfort, which... Um, you know, everybody, everybody knows of cotton as a great t-shirt material, also great sock material for its softness and its comfort. Um, I think I'm just going to give you a few detail shots of some of those patterns. Um, that nice kind of geometric uh, parallelogram pattern there. Uh, looks like eight parallelograms arrayed around a center point there with some accents in uh, the lighter thread there. And then a nice bar here with some uh, diamond pattern in the center. And you see the same thing over on the um, the pair in black here as well. Um, just really nice. Uh, seem to be good quality. Um, I'm just going to try a pair on real quick for you guys, just to give you an idea of um, of how these work, you know, in action. So if you give me just a second here, I'm going to unpackage them and. Uh, I guess we'll go with the um, plain, kind of plain black uh, argyle pattern ones first. Um, get the zip tie thing undone here. There we are. And get those out of the way. They're a nice long sock too, which I like. Um, I like a sock that's going to stay up, not be drooping all the time. Um, <clears throat> Get that blanket out of the way there for you. Um, as you can see, seems to be a nice fit. Um, pattern's not deformed too much by the uh, actually being worn. Um, definitely feels nice, nice and thin. Um, I don't like bulky socks that get kind of bunched up, things like that. So all in all, I think there's going to be some good socks. Obviously, I have to put some mileage in them before um, before we'll be able to know for sure whether these are. Uh, a good buy, but I'll keep you guys posted. Um, so if you're in the market for socks, um, I think these are a good buy. Um, other than that, I think uh, I think I'm going to try the rest of these on uh, tonight. Um, I'll update with any um, issues as they arise. Uh, everyone else have a good night and keep your feet warm.